As we mentioned earlier, Time & Status can show its report data in various chart types. You will see the chart button for each row when you hover over that row with your mouse pointer. Clicking the button will open a window that shows the charts. There are various chart types here including bar charts, column charts, pie charts and some clustered charts. The available chart types vary based on the report type. Date reports also have timeline charts available for them. The exclude current state button is very useful here. When you are looking at an issue that wasn't updated for a long time, let's say for weeks or months, the latest status of the issue will completely dominate the chart and other statuses become indistinguishable. For those cases, you enable the exclude current state switch and the chart will ignore the time since the latest status or assignee update. This way, previous changes will become more visible. On the chart window, you can also use the download button to get the chart as an image file. List reports can show you charts for each individual issue. For average and sum reports, you can get charts for each group. And also for average and sum reports, you can get an overall chart for the whole report, comparing all groups. Now let's get back to the toolbar. 